Good morning, all of you. My name is K. Hamlata. I am working as CRT PS in KGBV Sabbavaram, Vishaka District. Dear student, this is 10th class revision class. Student, we uh, completed a uh, physics syllabus. So, just we are uh, Just uh, we recollecting uh, uh, that syllabus. Now we are going to uh, uh, learn uh, about the uh, refraction of light at a uh, plane surface. Um, Refraction of light at plane surface. Um, children, before uh, starting a lesson, first we see uh, what is the pattern of a physics paper, uh, which type of questions uh, may come. Uh, let us see. Uh, physics paper total marks 15, half mark questions. Uh, 6 marks and 1 mark questions 8 8 marks and 2 mark questions 8 16 marks and 4 mark questions 5 equal to 20 Three. only these topics are there uh, in our lesson children now um, we learn uh, refraction what is refraction? The process of changing the process of changing speed of light. Uh, Light to travel from travel from one medium to another medium. What is refraction? The process of light changing speed of light. One light to travel from one medium to another medium. Children, look at the picture. In this picture, this is rarer medium. This is denser medium. Light to travel from rarer medium to denser medium. Light to travel, light ray travel uh, from a uh, rarer to denser, uh, light ray towards the normal. And in, uh, in this case, when light to travel from denser to rarer, the light ray away from the, away from a uh, normal. So, children. We discuss about the second one is refractive index. What is refractive index? The ratio of the ratio of speed of light in vacuum. To the that speed of light in a in the medium. What is children? What is the refractive index? 
the ratio of speed of light in the vacuum to the speed of light in the medium and equal to c by v so our refractive index n c means the speed of light in a vacuum v speed of light in that medium so n means refractive index so what is refractive index the ratio of speed of light in vacuum to the speed of light in the medium and equal to c by v children now we discuss third point related to refractive index what is related to refractive index refractive index of second medium by refractive index of first medium related to so comparison of two refractive indexes children uh, we discuss about uh, lab activity what is lab activity in this lesson obtaining a relation between angle of incidence uh, and uh, angle of refraction that means uh, sin a by sin r is constant uh, we prove um, sin a by sin r is constant this lab activity is uh, very important um, okay children uh, we learned uh, um, about refraction of light at uh, plane surfaces Uh, now we discuss uh, which type of uh, questions uh, may come uh, in uh, um, our uh, physics exam let us see okay children now we learn uh, which type of questions uh, may give in examination um, first we see half mark questions in a lesson refraction of light at plane surface half mark questions are number 1 the ratio of the speed of light in vacuum to the in the medium is given what do you call this ratio s yes, refractive index of the medium next what do you call the process of changing speed of the light when light travels from one medium to another medium refraction already we learned so what do you call the process of changing speed of the light when light travels from one medium to another refraction yes on which property of the medium speed of the light depends yes optical density which law states that uh, sin a by sin r is constant yes snell's law what is the speed of the light in vacuum 3 into 10 power 8 how can you justify kerosene is denser than water by optical density now we learn to one mark question write the formula of uh, relative refractive index n equal to refractive index of second medium by refractive index of first medium which factor decide the speed of the light in the medium refractive index of the medium on which factors does the refractive index of medium depends first one nature of the material and second one wavelength of the light used what is angle of deviation the angle between incidence ray and uh, emergent ray is uh, known as angle of deviation what is fermat's principle the light ray always travels in a path which takes a shortest possible time to travel 
what happened to refractive index of air with high refractive index of air increase with high when does snell's law fails snell's law fails when light is incident normally on the surface of a refraction refracting medium now we see two mark questions why is the difficult to shoot a fish swimming in a water sorry next how do you appreciate the role fermat principle in a drawing ray drawing ray diagram how do you appreciate the role of fermat principle in drawing ray diagram this principle has lot of importance in optics this is used in laws of reflection laws of uh, refraction uh, to derive refractive index of a medium to derive uh, refractive index of a glass lab etc in which cases does a light ray not derive at the interface uh, of uh, two mediums and next uh, uh, then we see a campfire object beyond the fire or seems saying uh, give reasons next uh, we see four mark question in this lesson um, very important four mark question how do you verify experimentally that uh, sin a by sin r is a constant this is very important for our question so uh, children uh, you must learn uh, uh, these questions so um, uh, the refraction of light at plane surface uh, uh, lesson these are very important questions the refraction of uh, light at the curved surface uh, uh, very important topic uh, are there uh, that is uh, image formation of uh, lens uh, concave lens uh, image formation equal to uh, sorry concave convex lens uh, image formation equal to concave mirror image formation now we are learn now we are going to learn about uh, concave lens image formation first uh, um, uh, first uh, object kept in uh, six places the first one is the object placed at infinity that is one second the object beyond beyond the c object kept in we kept in object um, beyond c third object kept in on c the object placed on uh, between f and c next object kept in uh, uh, p and uh, between p and uh, f so which place uh, kept in a object uh, which type of image that is uh, size uh, dimension or uh, magnify uh, mm, next uh, which type of image found invert or erect and which type of uh, image found real or virtual let us see first we see uh, um, If, uh, object uh, at infinity we get the uh, object uh, at infinity the image formed the sixth fifth place we get object at first place image formed fifth place uh, when we get uh, object uh, in first place image uh, from the fifth place and object uh, uh, placed beyond c that is second place 
so in this case image formed fourth place the object placed on c image formed on c the object kept in a uh, between F and C, that is fourth place. Image formed the second place. Next, the object kept in a uh, between a P and F. Sorry, the object kept in a focal, that place a fifth. The image formed the first place. The object kept in a sixth place between F and C. Image formed behind the P. Okay. Now we learned when we uh, object uh, kept in places um, image formed places ok next which type of image formed uh, the uh, diminished or magnified 1 to 5th place 1 to 1 to 2nd place 1 comma 2 Places we kept uh, when we kept in object uh, when we kept uh, object uh, image small image form small when we object kept three place image equal image form when we object kept four or five places. Image found, big image found. And next, which type of image found? Inverter, erect. Let us see. 1 to 5 images or invert images. One to five, we kept on we kept five places, uh, we kept object uh, five places. The object, when we, uh, the object kept in five places, uh, the image uh, will form the invert image. The object kept in sixth place, image formed erect. Last one. 1 to 5 places images are real images. Sixth place images only virtual. Hello. Hmm. Children, look at the book. This is principal axis. This is concave mirror. This is center of curvature. This is focal point. This is pole. Once again, now we will add um, image formation. First um, Object uh, kept in first place, image form fifth place. Object kept in second place, image form fourth place. Object kept in third place, image form third place. Object kept in fourth place, image form second place. Object kept in fifth place, image form first place. What is first, second, third, fourth, fifth place, uh, sixth places? 
first place is uh, in snati second place is beyond the sea third place is on the sea fourth place is between f and c fifth place is on focal point sixth place is uh, uh, between uh, p and f next which type of image formed 1 to uh, image uh, uh, kept in 1 to 2 places we kept uh, uh, when uh, when the object uh, kept uh, at uh, one two uh, places uh, image will form the small so one two second place images uh, one two second place images small and third place image equal and four five places image are uh, big okay children Okay, uh, one two places, uh, one two, uh, one comma two place uh, object. We kept uh, uh, a small image found. Uh, we kept uh, uh, object uh, three place uh, image equal image found. Four five places uh, image big image. Next, uh, we see that type uh, that uh, image uh, invert or erect let us see um, when we when the object placed at uh, one to five places uh, image will be found uh, invert uh, when the object placed at uh, sixth uh, image uh, will be found uh, erect and last one uh, the image uh, real or virtual let us see when the object placed uh, 1 to 5 uh, at image uh, uh, are real. The image form real. Uh, when the object uh, uh, placed at the uh, sixth uh, image will be formed a bitch. By practice in this uh, you can yeah, you can answer any question Not. children be prepared well be safe at home thank you